Hello, 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 and welcome to my channel. We are back in the game of Planet Crafter. We are starting a brand new game. As you see, I have no base up there at all. Our T points are at zero. We have first step instructions. And I'm kind of looking forward to seeing if I missed anything. So yeah, before we get started though, let me remind everybody, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please click that subscribe button down there and hit that little bell next to it and you'll get notified next time I put out one of these awesome videos. And be sure to leave a comment. I do enjoy your comment. And um, click them likes. Them likes are very important. It shows me that you guys appreciate what I'm doing here. So um, without wasting any more time, let's start playing some Planet Crafter. So here we are on our barren planet. I guess we should name this Mastopia. Um, but yeah, I've gone out and I mined a few things. I haven't built anything yet. So the first thing on our list is craft a backpack, equip the backpack, then do the same thing for the oxygen and craft a uh, construction chip. We're gonna do one more. And that's the deconstruct chip also. So we're going to click into our crafting station. First I'll show you I've harvested this right here. This is what I need. So we're going to get the um, oxygen tank. We're going to get the backpack. The construct chip. And the deconstruct chip. Oh, I need one more magnesium. Let's go grab that. Where are you at? Good deal. Now let's equip the backpack. And these two. Now I can construct this, but I'm not going to be able to equip it. But we can take the, um, we can take this on, or this deconstruct on and off as we need the flashlight. But we're going to add the oxygen. Alright, so let's check out our little life pod here. We do have this message. Nothing's changed in the message. We have a storage. A little bit of food, some oxygen, some water. So the first thing I want to do is start building my base. We're going to need iron and titanium and silicon. Oh, the sound of that. All right, I waited for the storm to pass. So the first thing I want to do is build a base. We need a six compartment uh, living area with a door and then we'll have to build our T2 crafting station in there and then start laying this stuff down so we can start bringing our T points up so yeah as always I'm gonna build my base up here at the top of the leaning rock because we all know this is gonna be underwater quite deep so um yeah let me do the little coin flip and I'll see you up there once I get the six pods in place All right, we are here still at the pod. I do have my base constructed up there. I came back down here to grab some more iron and I took the locker and everything that was in it. So my inventory is pretty full at the moment. This is what was in my locker that I had remaining. And then when I deconstructed the locker, I got an iron for that. So we're gonna run up here to our base and start building some stuff now. 
I did make this base two floors, but we won't be able to access the second floor until we unlock the ladder. But for now, I have everything built, so once I get to that point, I don't have to scramble to get resources to build that part. But this is my base. It's a six block layout. I found that that works out perfectly for me, and then once we advance, this bottom part here is all I need, and then we'll attach our domes to that. And then inside the door, I always like to put four lockers right up front here for dumping off stuff. I found that four is like the perfect number because you come in and go so often that it don't take long to fill these up. And as long as you're diligent and you empty these out and organize them and store them. So that's what my bottom floor is going to mainly be is my storage area. And then we'll put maybe some plant growers down there or something, but... Yeah, I'm going to put my heaters over here. And then we'll put our plants over here. Um, we'll put our desk here with our meters and our uh, monitors. And then maybe down below we'll put in our T2 crafting bench. But for now we need our, our T3 crafting bench. But for now we need the T2. So let's pop that in here. Alright. So now with this, I think we can not upgrade. But we can construct the exoskeleton now. So let's go get a titanium, silicon, and a magnesium. Alright, we have what we need to build the exoskeleton. But first we need to throw down some power. So we're going to create some of these wind turbines. That's what I got all the iron for. Alright. That should power us for a good while. Not forever, but for a little while. Alright, now what do I need for this? So we go in here, we could take off this, put on that, then we add that. Let's go get a flashlight. There we go. Feeling better. Alright, so what do we need to do? We need to start our T points. Let's build all our monitors and stuff. And let's get the desk going. We can build one of these. I'll have to go out and get more iron. Put that right on that X. There we go. And then... Do I have more iron? All right, not bad at all. So our monitors, we are going to need three irons, two, three silicons, a magnesium, and a cobalt. All right. So we got a blueprint screen. We got a power screen. And then our status screen. We're going to put over here. Everything's reading zeros at the moment. So the first thing we're going to knock out is these drills. We'll get a bunch of them put in. Four of them. So we're going to need four irons and four titaniums. Let's go do it. Alright, so before I lay down these drills, let me show you what we're working for. If you look under our blueprint screen, you see all this stuff is unlocked. 
or uh, it's all locked. All this stuff at the end is what we want most. But to get to the end, we have to go through all this stuff in the beginning. So we are about to throw down some drills, which will cause pressure. As these pressure points build up, these things will unlock at certain pressure um, points. Same thing with the heat, and same thing with the oxygen. So we have everything we need to make heat, pressure, and oxygen. Let's put them over here. I might as well put them underneath, why not? And we are generating pressure. There we go. Things are moving. And because things are moving, this is moving. So the faster you can get these three things moving, the faster this top one will unlock. And this top one, it has our tier 2 crafting bench. And it's got our rocket launcher and our water filter. We can drink water straight from the lakes with this thing. Very, very nice. So the next thing we need to craft is heat. So we're going to run over to the sand caves. Check that out. See if there's anything new over there. I want to look at that new biome entrance and see if that's all sealed off. I'm pretty sure it's going to be. But yeah, let's go over and get some iridium. And we'll pick up a couple of irons and silicon while we're on our way. Oh look, we've got the new backpack already. Every time I head over here, something unlocks. And that's just on our pressure so far. So all that's going to fill up is water down there. Alright, so let's check out this entrance up here. Yeah, see it's all sealed up. So it looks like you have to wait until you bring your T-points up and melt this down. This looks like a big chunk of ice. But once you melt this down, there's a whole nother biome on the other side. Alright, here we are back. I think I have what we need to build our, um... I need this silicon, not that. And we need four of them, five of them. Ah, we'll just build four of them. There we go. Now our heat index is moving. Next on the list, oxygen. So we need um, iron, ice, and magnesium. We have three irons, so we just need one more iron and four ice and four magnesiums. All right, before I lay out these bed tubes, I wanna look at my power. Yeah, see, I only have that much available. And our veg tubes are going to pull 0.35. Hmm. I think by the fourth one, we're going to lose power. Still looking good. Oh, can we get the last one in? Yes. We still have power. Wow, not much though. One more would have killed it. 
All right, so we only have one seed so far. But we are going to go visit some places to go get some more seeds. Because at the moment, we did what we need to do here. All our stuff is generating. Our, our transformation points are going up. Soon we'll have... Um, oh, we did get the backpack. Soon we'll have solar panels for more power than the bigger backpack. And then, yeah, the indoor ladder's coming soon. Bigger heaters, another oxygen. We won't use this veg tube too. Yeah, we will use the veg tube too. No. No, I always skip these. I go straight to the biodomes. Alright, so we need seeds. A lot of seeds. In order to get seeds... We are going to visit... I guess we'll start by visiting... I don't want to visit over there because that cave system is going to be blocked off just like this one was. We have to bring our T-points up and then we'll go over there and visit that. But for now we're going to go to the aluminum field and see if we can't get some seeds over there. But I do know this ship here has got seeds in it. We need a silicon and a titanium. We have the titanium. We just need to run out and grab a silicon real quick. Then we need to take this backpack off. But we will have to put some stuff down. Alright. Oh, not bad, not bad. Could be better, but not bad. Alright, so we are going to head over to the aluminum field. We are going to drink some water, eat some food, and away we go. New plant plant, the veg tube too. Alright, here we are in the aluminum field. Well, that's what I call it. I don't know what the official name for this is. But we're going to head straight for the spacecraft and get in there and get out. And then we'll grab as much as we can before we die. Then I don't have to walk all the way back. Oh, no seeds. Alright, I think we have a golden seed. in these golden chests back here. There's one back here and there's one on the way back to our base. We'll grab this one over here. There should be a golden seed in here. Yes. And... I don't want that. These things, every time I try to spawn them into my base, it glitches them out. It glitches out my base and it just completely wrecks everything. Alright, we are starting to head back. You can see the top of my base over there. Over there's the crash ship. And right there's our golden chest. Grab this seed. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, these are 600. This is 300. I want them both. I want that. I'm going to throw you in there and you in there and take you and you. And I'll get rid of you. We'll take you. And you. Hmm, let's eat that and take that. 
Good deal. Alright, so while we're waiting for our T points to build up, we have a little ways to go before anything gets unlocked now. That's got a little ways to go. That's got glides to go. I don't even want that. Or no, it's this I don't want. But, um... Yeah, I could start putting some windows in. We have another meteor shower coming. So we're going to walk through the meteor shower and we're going to head over to that crash site. Right over there. Oh, wait. Alright, so I had to turn the volume down. That got kind of loud. Do so we need two looms, a titanium, and a silicon? We don't have it. There's a titanium. Oh, look at that. Much better, much better. All right, so what do we need for the T2 drill? Iron and titanium. Got some iron, no titanium. So that was two titanes to every iron. There is my, <clears throat> there is my and door ladder. We are back. We are going to throw some bigger drills down. Now we already know the first time I drop something we're going to lose power. But that's okay. Alright, I anticipated this, and I am prepared to lay down some solar panels. I need one more iron and two more cobalts. And yes, nope. There we go. We still don't have a whole lot available. So our next solar panel is still a little ways off. And our baby nuke is quite a ways off. Alright, so uh, now I don't believe we have anything unlocking. Oh, we do have our ladder. Let's get that installed. So I'm going to need to build one more pod and a door. So I need two titaniums and two irons. Alright, so I don't want a door. Or do I want a door? Yeah, let's put a door down here. And then we're going to build a ladder going up to that door. That's not working out. There, so we built ourselves our own little stairs because the ladder it just wasn't fitting. It was too big. It was standing up too tall.
That one landed on my base. Alright, so I created this door here on the bottom part of my new base. This is where we're going to put the ladder in. So, right above me are fabricators right here. Our, all right, we have that now. Our craft station T2 is right here, right above us. So I'm gonna put our ladder right across from that. Beautiful. Yep, there's our crafting station right across from our ladder. Couldn't ask for a better place to put it. Alright, so this down here, I think is where I'm going to put my T2 crafting station. I like that spot. And then, I'm going to line my walls with um, storage down here. And this is basically my storage. So what do we have now to build? We've got glass floors. I do want to put that in where the... Um, Where the ladder is. I need one more titanium. Oh yes, we definitely gotta install that. So we need an iron, two silicons, and a cobalt. I believe I've collected all the resources I need here. Beautiful. So now what this is going to tell us is what stage we are in the terraformation. We are still in the barren stage. What little bit of energy that we're producing with these three um, subjects is bringing our status to blue skies slowly by so surely but as soon as we hit blue skies we'll have so much installed that this thing will just be rolling and then um after blue skies we've got clouds and then after clouds we got rains and then we got lakes and then we got i know there's insects and plants and all that coming but um a prelude or prologue we don't need that. Alright, so here's our stairs. I want to install the floor. There we go. So now, where our ladder is, we can see all the way down. And then we can see all the way up. The guy gives us that perspective. Alright, there's a whole upper section. Let's go up there and check that out. Yeah, like it. We're looking at this at five. We're not even close. This is the food grower. We need to go get the seeds so we can be ready for that. So our next venture is going to be the crash ship directly behind us. Um, do we have water? Let's grab some water and oxygen. And we got two foods. So we're going to hit that up. Hit that up. And we have oxygen on us and another water. All right. Let's head over here to this ship. And here we are. We're going to hit our F key, turn our lights on. So we are looking for seeds mostly. Eggplant. A plants and mushrooms is what we need the most. These um layer mud plants, we need those for the biodomes. Yeah, we might as well eat that while we're here. I've seen them put seeds on these shelves. Hundred and fifty, hundred and fifty, two hundred. 
Yeah, we don't exactly need those right away. Alright, so there's all of our iron. I think I have seeds over here. Nope, I don't have seeds anywhere. I do have aluminum over here. And we're gonna go get some more ice and cobalt to make more oxygen and water and then we're gonna head out. I was gonna go back to my ship to make this stuff, but I figured we'll just hit up the shuttle over here and use that uh, fabricator since it's kind of on the way. Kind of. It'll be the last time we'll step foot in this little pod. Next time we look at this thing, it'll be underwater. Alright, we are set. Let's head up top mountain here. Alright, here we are at the big mother sh part of the ship. But I am going to build a little outpost over here. What is that? Is that another cave entrance? There is another cave entrance over here. How about that? I didn't even know about this one. See, aren't you guys glad you were watching my stream so you can see this in here? Oh, now I'm stuck. Let's see if I can't go up this way. There we go. That was close. So, before I saw that cave over here, I meant to, um... There's our new solar panels. Build a little life pod over here. Especially now that I know that cave is there. Oh, we need one more titanium. Alright. So now we are good for a checkpoint. So if we do die, we'll spawn right outside the ship. My inventory is light. Turn on our light. Another eggplant. Never any oxygen in there. So I believe that's it for this ship. Let's go out here. I've got room. Yep. Let's go collect some of the stuff out of the golden chest. We could drop off you and you. I want to keep that. Alright, looking good. Let's head back to base. We'll teleport. Oh, I forgot we set our spawn point here. Haha. <laughs> So yeah, we definitely want to watch out for this cave too. We're walking on the bottom of a lake bed at the moment. Let's 
So we got the eggplant seeds. We're covered with that. I got more than enough of that. Now I need some of those um, mushroom seeds. Alright, where we're heading now is over there. Or maybe it's over there. But there's one more crash ship that we need to check out. And it's hidden behind all that dust back there. But it's such a long walk. I want to make four oxygens to take with me. So I got four oxygens and three waters. And uh, we'll grab one more food. Do I have any more food? Maybe not. We'll find some food on the way. So let's head over here now and let's get this going. Let me drop off all this iron. Put a couple in there. And put a couple in there. So you see now why I need four totes? It don't take long at all to fill these up. And by the time I do fill them up, I should be unlocking my um, bigger storage. Alright, so this biome it was one of the newer biomes that was added in the last update. And that ship here is the biggest ship on the map at the moment. This one has an upstairs and a downstairs. Pretty cool little um, flight deck here. Bunch of little chairs and terminals and whatnots. Pretty cool. Alright, so when you get into this ship, you want to go this way first. Knock out this little area. Oh yeah, we'll take that. We got a new oxygen tank unlocked. Bean seeds. I don't want no bean seeds. I want mushroom seeds. That's a lot of iron. Alright, we got some seeds in here. We'll pick them up for now. I don't know if I'll keep them or not. We do have an upstairs we'll have to check out. Inventory full. So we can get rid of these 200s. Oh no! I absolutely wasn't paying attention to my oxygen. But we do have the compass now. Let's uh, take this one off, put this one on. We're going to need another storage. For all this stuff. How far are we away from our lockers? Did we just unlock the compass? We need 50. I think I'm going to wait until I build the lockers before we go back over there. Because I have more than enough here now. 
We're going to get the new oxygen tank. That's what we're going to work on now. Let's see where we are with our skies. Alright. So our new oxygen tank, I need titanium, silicon, magnesium, and aluminum. Alright, we just need the old oxygen tank. Alright, now we're up to 280. I want the bigger backpack though. What are we on? We are at the T3. We are going to need the new crafting station to get to the T4. And that is coming... After our lockers. So we're still not even halfway to our lockers. Alright, we need more mushrooms because this is coming. So I'm going to build... I'm actually going to build a life pod over there. So we're going to need... Um, three irons. Let's see here. I want to put you guys in there. We need three irons and a titanium. And a silicon. Two titaniums and a silicon. Oh my gosh, everything's so full. I'm just going to have to build another locker. I hated to do it, but I had to. Alright, I am building me a lot of oxygen. I guess that's it. Let me go out and get one more cobalt. There's one right there. And we'll build one more oxygen. So now I got one, two, three, four, five, six oxygens and enough materials to build a base over there. So let me um, drink a water now and let's head over. Alright, after what seemed like a forever journey, we finally made it back over here to the big ship. Let's toss down a little life pod here. We'll set our checkpoint. Get some oxygen. Alright, now let's go in here and finish scouting out this ship. So at the moment we were upstairs, I believe. Or no, we were going through this area over here. Oh, we were dropping stuff, I think. Yeah, because we didn't go that way yet. There's nothing in here. What was the point of that? You robbed me. Nothing that way, right? Alright. Nothing this way. This looks like the bridge or something up here. Ooh, there's some of that bioplastic nuggets. We are at 18%. Look at that. Now all my chests are filled. That's terrible. 
we need things to be unlocked here so we're going to build our compass next because this is so close so close So we need a silicon and a magnesium. Yep. Alright, so we need to take something off. I'm thinking about the mining speed because the mining speed doesn't do much for me. We'll pop that on there. Now look at that. We got a compass at the top. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, so as you see, we still have a little ways to go before we unlock our next items. Uh, the exosuit, the next T3 drill, and then the biodome. Nuclear power is coming up. So a lot of this is a lot of sitting and waiting until I get some more of this unlocked. So what I think I'm going to do is end this episode here because in real time I've actually been recording for almost two and a half hours. Two and a half hours for this little bit of video that you guys watched today. That's a lot of me running around, mining up stuff, trying to find iron and all this stuff and doing the building and all that. But yeah. Let me know what you guys think. We discovered a new cave up there. Oh, that was unexpected. That leads me to think there could be more. There could be more. So yeah, stay tuned. Make sure you are hitting that bell so you are notified next time I do put out one of these videos. Leave a comment. Click that like button. I'll be disappointed if you don't. See you guys next time. Thanks for watching.